this Friday coming out in a theater near you is the movie Split, which is a very interesting movie that follows the main character of the film that has multiple personality disorders. But as the film progresses, we find that not only does his personality change, but quite possibly his entire body as well. Whether he's some type of mythical being or monster, we don't know. But knowing that M. Night Shyamalan's behind the helm, I'm sure it will be revealed in some unexpected twist. Reviews are already coming in for the movie, and this is looking to be the best movie for him since The Sixth Sense. Next we are talking about the Samsung Galaxy S8. Now Samsung has been hush hush as usual about their upcoming phone, but due to the failure of the Note 7, they are wanting to rush and get their next device out in the market so we can forget our Note 7 woes. Now some of the rumors have been that they are working on edge-to-edge -edge bezel-less displays, meaning you don't have all that extra junk at the top or bottom of the phone, but the whole front is practically a screen entirely. Now, this, this makes sense as it would continue to develop the edge to the edge technology that Samsung has uh, come up with, come up with uh, which is a signature look for such phones as the Galaxy S6 and S7. So the S8 should follow this same trend. Now, this is just rumor and speculation, but Samsung has recently revealed a new advertisement talking about uh, their new screens and whatnot, and they see that, seem to have pre-rendered images of what people are seeming calling the Galaxy S8. Now this has neither been confirmed nor denied by Samsung, but it is looking like images of the phone have already surfaced online and it seems very plausible that this could be our very first look at the Galaxy S8. Injustice 2 is an upcoming video game coming out in May of 2017 and this is the sequel to the 2013 hit Injustice. Now this follows the storyline of a corrupt Superman and a rebellious Batman as they draw lines and fight one another in their teams of heroes and villains that fight uh, for their chance of survival. And of course the story still follows the continuation of the story of Injustice 1. Now not much has been revealed in the plot but just yesterday a story trailer has been revealed and now we know a little bit more about who the antagonist may be, such as Brainiac. If you pre-order the game now, as a bonus, you can play as the evil Superman villain, Darkseid. Get your copy now.